All right, welcome back in everyone. Today we're going to do a little bit different video. Uh, I went and tested every single block type with this material right here, the ectoplasm block, to find out what we could or what we could not place in line into a wall and not have it go all jank. And I'll explain what I mean by jank. It doesn't do it with the uh, new blocks, or I should say, it is the new blocks that cause the problem, and then there are a total of 12 that also do the same thing. So the new red marble and the new hollow block, doo -doo -doo, hollow halls block, red marble block, what you notice is if you put the, and this is ectoplasm block, it's the quote stained glass, if you put it in line, meaning you don't stick it one row back, like this. You put it in line with the block, the other block, whatever it is you're using, you notice that this left side has the correct frame, the right side it's missing. And it's that way on all 12 of these blocks. This one's missing a whole column. This one has a row of blocks, so does that one up left side, nothing on the right side, same here, same here. And this wood, you've got a I don't know, a, a wood member running vertically, nothing on the right. This has the little little jut outs, whereas this does not. I don't know what the hell's going on with this. Why? Why? Really? Why? What, what, what's happening, bro? And then palm wood and your tarred wood do the same thing. Here's the interesting part. It's flipped on the back. I mean, it's, it's not flipped. It's still the left side. So whatever is going on with these 12 blocks... The left side, when you place the ectoplasm block in line, is correct, meaning that is the correct position. Because if I were to take out this glass block, you would notice that the frame is back. So the frame is correct without the block there. When I place the block there, I'll just go ahead and do a double so it's faster the right side disappears and it does it for all 12 of these. I'll show you the box real quick. So it is rough wood, tarred wood, refined wood, the half timbered block unfortunately cuz it's such a gorgeous block, palm wood, roughly cut stone, city wall block, regular stone block, desert city wall, desert temple block and that's also a shame. And then the two new ones, hollow halls and marble. Now, I'm not counting ectoplasm because it is its own block. So let's look at what does work. So as you might imagine, all of the uh, glow blocks work perfectly fine. So you notice there's nothing different between the left and the right side. It looks exactly the same. Same with all of the metal blocks. And again, again this is kind of how you would expect because when you place this down, it basically is a metal block. You can hear the sound that you do when you place a metal block. So it is basically the same thing. Now we get into your other. Uh, this is first we have shroud wood. And yes, I know there's a weird thing up there, but that has nothing to do with this. That's just the block itself. We have bone block and we have the uh, well block. Now, in my opinion, well block looks like it's literally meant for this stained glass block. It frames it perfectly. It looks perfect. It just, yeah, it fits in my opinion. Now, I do want to say, I would not normally place this block in line. I would do it like this because I think it looks better. It has a better appearance. But I don't know, maybe there's something you want to do with it. There's some kind of pattern you're trying to get out of this and you need it to be in line and therefore this test shows you what will and won't work. So now we get into our stone type blocks. All of these work, your clays, your, uh, this is the, uh, I'll, I'll go through the whole list. This is your, um, oh man, flint, flintstone. Your castle, all of these guys work. Then we get into your more deserty, your more adobe look. All of the, the the sandy ones work. Now, one could argue, okay, but there's this tiny little bit sticking out there, and it's not on the right, so therefore debunked. Well, you're not wrong, 
but it looks so close that I'm not that worried. Now I did two of the fancy block because I wanted you to see it in the Adobe, the rammed earth type of look and inside of the, even though this is stone at the bottom, it looks like wood, you can see looks fantastic. I mean, it looks like it's meant to be there. Now, again, I wouldn't put it in line, but it looks fine. Now here are two honorable mentions. This is fancy stone and you notice, did I call that fancy stone? This is fancy stone. Um, you notice there's that tiny little lip right there and there's no tiny little lip right here. Very similar to that block. But I think the effect is so minimal that I don't really care. I th These two are honorable mentions this is mycelium. Now mycelium does it full on. Uh, you can see this left side has the stuff. The right side does not have the stuff. But here's my take on mycelium. Mycelium is already a weird block to begin with. I mean, look how you got mushrooms growing out on one side. You got them coming out of the wall on this side. If we go to the back, it's all kinds of weird messed up. So I think it's enough of a weird block to begin with that it doesn't matter that the ectoplasm block is kind of messing with it. So in if you want to be technical, it's 15 total blocks that it messes up because we got to count these two and this one right here. But we'll call all these honorable mentions. So let's go over the list of what you can use. So of course, it's all the glow blocks, including the new green luminescent and the new white or warm white luminescent block, which is funny. I don't know if the devs put this in because someone made a joke about it. They actually made the they made this uh, like a, the card for it, like you see right here, but then changed the color. I don't think they called it white, uh, warm white luminescent, but I don't know. They changed it to something else. I think they just said warm luminescent, and then all of a sudden we had it. I'm like, that's pretty cool. Anyway, it's all the metals, so iron, bronze metal and copper. It is only shroud wood. There is no other wood that it works with. You have rough stone, rough flint stone, both of the fried uh, bricks and the rough sandstone, so your sand bricks. You got castle stone, refined stone, and weathered stone block. Now for your more adobe-like stuff, you got refined sandstone, regular sandstone, limestone, and fancy stone block. Sorry, fancy was the one and the highly polished. I Man, I, I get those mixed up. Now we got bone block and well block for the kind of other category. Well block is the one that I think it just, it looks perfect, like it's literally meant to be there. And then our honorable mentions of highly polished stone block and the mycelium overgrown. And again, this is using the ectoplasm block to make a stained glass window look. So that was my, uh, my little foray into a test of naughtiness today. And hopefully um, the devs will figure out why these guys are all doing it and only on the left side, like that one. Whereas all these guys, it works just fine. It's kind of weird that it only 12 of them, technically 15, uh, don't work, but then all the rest do. So I don't know what's going on there. Anyways, thanks for watching, everybody.